How's it going guys? New here back with the second opening of our introductory series, or at least the reshoot of our introductory series, and this time we're doing Flash Fire. I'm pretty sure I go there goes XY Flash Fire, then Furious Fist. I always get Furious Fist and Flash Fire mixed around. I can never remember which one's second, which one's third. So I'm pretty sure I got this right, but yeah, we've got four packs of Flash Fire, we've got Mega Charizard X, Pyro, Mega Charizard Y, and Mega Kangaskhan, so that's pretty cool. We've got one of each pack art. Couldn't get that organized for the last one, but hopefully I'll manage to do that for the rest of the series. And last time I only did six videos up to Roaring Skies, because that was what was out when I was recording stuff like that. This time I might see if I can get some Ancient Origins and Breakthrough stuff. Uh, yeah, we'll see how we go with that. So we'll leave the two Charizards for last, I reckon. We'll start off with the Pyro. <laughs> Here we go, so we've got the code card, it's not backwards form, so I was about to do that backwards because I was used to it facing the wrong way. And we're going to 32, I'm, I'm really annoyed that I've lost some one of my, my videos as well because the one I did this the first time around, I actually managed to pull a secret rare friggin' Kangaskhan. So I don't have that me pulling that on video anymore, which kind of sucks. But that's alright anyway, so we'll start off with the Duskull, Centret, Phoebus, Geodude, I like that artwork, that looks kind of cool. Litleo, one of two in the set, Pokemon Fan Club, Floet, Furfru, a Miltank Reverse, which I don't think I'd pulled in reverse yet, that's cool, and the rare is a Floet. Is it Floet's a friggin' rare? It should be Floetry, that's bullshit. Anyway, um, if you'll excuse me for two seconds, I'm just going to quickly turn the light on here because it looks a bit dark in here. Good. That is hopefully a little bit better, and hopefully you guys can see a bit more clearly. Whoops. Bumping the camera, way to go me. That's what happens when you're trying to attach it to the back of a friggin' chair and you sit down on it. Anyway, we move on to our second pack, which is the Mega Kangaskhan. Which really doesn't look that much different from regular Kangaskhan, really. That's something that a lot of people have had that problem without a few Mega Pokemon. They don't look too much different from their regular versions. Anyway, um, yeah. So, a little bit more around myself. I actually work in retail. I work for my local Target. Which is good because we get Pokemon cards in that I usually buy. I'm probably the only one buying them from my store. But the only catch is, means that friggin' we don't get jack shit in usually. So I'm still waiting, I'll put it this way. It's, um, Breakthrough's just been released and I'm still waiting for my store to get in more of the Ancient Origins single packs. Like we've got in the three pack promos and the blister and the, yeah, the blisters and um, the um, pin blisters. But we still haven't got any of the um, single packs that we sell in yet, which is really starting to shit me off. Now, we've already got in the frickin', um, you know, the most recent set of three tins that we had in the um, Hooper. What were the other two? Hooper, was it Lugia or La... No, one of the Latioses, I think. Latios or Latios. And, um... Shit, I can't remember the third one. You know, laugh at me in the comments if you want, because I really can't friggin' remember right now. <laughs> But yeah, whatever the most recent three tins are that just came out just before Breakthrough came out, we just got them in. We're still waiting on friggin' some Ancient Origins stock, if you can figure that shit out. But fortunately, where I work, I've also got two really good card shops that get stuff in really quickly. As well as I've got a buddy who works in one of them who usually helps me out. If he's watching this, shout out to a guy, Phil, who works at a local place called The Hobby Matrix. If you live in Adelaide, check him out. He's really awesome. But yeah, so we've got Phoebus, Bergmite, Caterpie, Pidgey, Helioptile, Metapod, Sneasel, Avalug, Reverse Litleo, I've already pulled that I'm pretty sure. I've definitely got one of the Litleos in Reverse, one I don't, so we'll have to see which one I've got. I can't remember, I'm pretty sure it's this one though. And the ray is a Skuntank, so that's jack shit. So the other two didn't do stuff all for us, but hopefully the Mega Charizard packs will do something for us. We'll start off with the Charizard Y. I think it's I know personally that's for the Charizard X design a little bit more, just the black and blue looks really really awesome with the blue flame. And we will go... It doesn't feel like anything, it just sucks. So I really wish I hadn't done that. Um, Alright, so we've got a Flabebe, Scraggy, Screlp, Seedup, Sneasel, Love Disc, Pokemon Center Lady, Rapidash, Dusclops, and the rate is a barbarical, so three packs so far, absolutely nothing. No, that's, I think we used up all the good luck on the last one because we've got two hollows straight off the bat. But that's all right, we'll do our last pack here with the Mega Charizard. Hopefully it will bring us something good because again, I don't have a lot of the X's from the Flashfire set yet. 
the last time unfortunately I didn't get back into it too long after this set was out so unfortunately I didn't get all the sort of you know seems to be you get decent luck you get really good pulls when the set first comes out everything's like massively friggin overhyped and stuff like that so you, the, the um, packs are really heavily weighed so you get massive amounts of EX to start with but that's alright anyway we'll take our last pack here we've got a Centret, Helioptile, a Flabebe, Pidgey, Phoebus, Sligu, Metapod, Graveler, Rosalia Reverse, and the rare is a Butterfree. So we got absolutely nothing from that one. I'm not even going to bother recapping pulls because it's pointless. Probably should have done that last video, but I completely forgot. You have to forgive me, I'm still getting back into this sort of shit. Oh god, but yeah, so nothing from there, but that's alright. So I'll be back next time with Furious Fists. And we'll see how we go then. Thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you'll like and subscribe if you enjoyed this. And we'll see you next time.